After 26 years, Truett Kinna is hanging up the whistle. Kinna coached 546 games and had stops in Wolf Point, Augusta, and twice in Sims. It's been, you know, something I've been thinking about, but uh, it's not a bad thing. You know, it's just uh, you, when you look back at your career and you think of all the bus rides and all the morning practices and the after school late practices and stuff, uh, that maybe there's, you know, some time to do some other things. Kinna got his start as a head coach unexpectedly. It was 1994 in his hometown of Wolf Point where he woke up to a phone call one Saturday morning. Apparently the night before at the girls basketball game there was a little incident and uh, they uh, decided to uh, uh, fire the coach and they said we needed a coach to go to <laughs> Malta tonight to go ahead and play. We were wondering if you wanted to do it. I had to go up against, uh, or we had to go up against uh, Linda Cummings and Cheryl Keller, who eventually played for the Grizzlies, and then, uh, of course, Hall of Fame coach Del Freed, and uh, got out of there by losing by 62. <laughs> Wherever he coached, one of Kenna's goals was to bring home a trophy. The Augusta boys won three straight District 8C titles under his watch, and he added three 10C titles with the Sims girls later. But despite all that, Kenna will remember the friendships the most. I think when I really think about it, I think of uh, the relationships with the kids. Um, I've been in one of my players' weddings. Uh, I keep in touch with a lot of my players. And, you know, those are the memories that you're always going to have. You're always going to have that. My best friends, you know, are our coaches. Um, and the coaches that you get to hang out with, you do summer camps with, um, you go to coaches' clinic. Um, you go co coach all-star games with them. Um, I could name a ton of them, but I, I don't know. I'd probably leave one out or something. <laughs> and though basketball fans will still see Kinna around, he is looking forward to some free time. You don't have a weekend that's tied down, and now you can just uh, you can get up and go anytime you want. So I'm going to enjoy that. Isaiah Dunk, MTN Sports.